Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. Today I'm going to be doing a on-the-go makeup look. So this is something where I'm already out. I don't have any makeup on and I make last minute plans and I need to look put together or I have an appointment that I forgot about and I didn't put any makeup on. So I just want to look more presentable, more put together, more wide awake, even everything out. This is just very simple on the go. I have everything in my makeup bag that is right here. Everything that I would need is here and I will just take it out and use it. So before we get into it, if you can please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not yet already. I would love to have you guys here. If you want to see how I create my on the go makeup look, then just keep on watching. So before we get into it, I just want to show you guys what I use for on the go, what's inside my bag. So the first thing is a beauty blender. I always put a beauty sponge inside here. The other item I have are little small brushes. So I have two little eye brushes, a blender and a flat brush. Then I have like what I call my blush brush. So just a nice fluffy brush and if it's perfect in the cheek area. Then I have this brush right here and they're all from Eco Tools except for my the last one I'm gonna show you. So the first three are from Eco Tools. This is also an Eco Tool brush, but this one I use to set my under eyes, powder all of my face. If I needed to use this as a bronzer, it works as well. So it's nicely flat shaped and fluffy, so it doesn't grip too much product. Um, and then the last brush is a Coastal Sense um, angled brush. I use this to bronze or contour whichever um, I desire at the time. This came in a little set that we got in BoxyCharm with the Coastal Sets palette that had the bronzer, highlighter, and the blush um, palette. So this is the brush that came with it and I always keep it in my makeup bag in case I need it. Then the other thing I have um, is this Urban Decay Quick Fix Hydra Charge Complexion Priming Spray. I love this little thing. It's so convenient to have in this size. I absolutely love it. The other primer that I have is by 3D Effect. is a flash cream radiant primer. It's SPF 15. It's a natural glow, healthy complexion primer. Now it looks like this. And this right here, not my favorite, but I will use it because it has SPF. But to be honest with you, if I'm not going to wear foundation, if I'm just going to wear concealer, I will skip out on this completely and just use a moisturizer um, that has SPF because this one gives you a radiant looking skin and it has little specks of glitter in it. Also, it changes color to pink when I rub it on my face. I don't like the look of that, so for that reason alone, I won't use this if I'm not going to wear um, foundation. So the next thing in this bag is this CC cream, this A Cosmetic CC cream. Um, this has SPF 50 and I love it for that reason. Here in Texas the weather is getting hot so I need something that's going to give me SPF and this will be the best thing that I have because the coverage on this is really good. The other thing I have in here is Wet n Wild Concealer. Now this is the Photo Focus Concealer. I have this one in light medium beige and I love this concealer. This concealer is so good. Now this other product that I have is the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Pressed. This is a little sample travel size that I, that I received. Now this right here, I'm starting to fall in love with this. I use it all over my face and I noticed that it kind of burrs all my pores and stuff so I really like this product. The other products that I have these don't always stay in my makeup bag I rotate these a lot depending on my mood but I have the Ciate um, bronzer it's a matte bamboo bronzer now I love this bronzer I thought I wouldn't love it but I really do um, just for a like contour bronzing action this works really well on my skin tone so I like that and then my favorite blush of the moment is by Essence satin touch blush it looks like this and this blush is just so beautiful it throws out more pigment on the cheeks than it does 
on the pan that you see it's really really beautiful and I love this blush at the moment I've already mentioned this in a favorite and I'm still loving it so the next product that I have are two mascaras now the mascaras this typically stays in here um, I like to use these on the go because I know they work really well um, this one is a Ampli mascara is an amplifying mascara serum and I really love this right here then the other one is my L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara in Carbon Black. I love this for the lower lash line. The next products that I have are my brow products. This one currently is the IT Cosmetics um, Universal Taupe. And on top of that, I use the Essence Make Me Brow in Brownie Brows. This one I love so much. My holy grail, I cannot live without this. The other products that I have here are just like lip balms and a lip gloss. Um, this one is Blistex, then the pop form. This one I love so much, especially in the winter time. I love it so much. My lips are always soft every time I use this. And then the other one that I use is a Chap Ice Medicated Balm. I just got this like at Dollar Tree or something. The next product that I have is by Too Faced, and this is a Sweet Peach Creamy Peach Creamy peach oil lip gloss and it's in the shade Papa Don't Peach. Now the other things that I carry in here are some blotting tissue from NYX. This is a green tea blotting paper. Now the other things that I have in here are some tweezers. Can't live without tweezers. I love having them near me. You just never know. Then I keep some nail glue um, just for emergencies and I have some Q-tips. And that is everything. So that is everything that I have in this bag. Um, it was a lot of stuff, but um, I don't use all of it all the time. But I like to keep it in my bag just in case. I'm going to go in with this Urban Decay Quick Fix Hydro Charge Complexion Prep Priming Spray. I'm going to go in with that on my face. Oh, This thing smells so good. Next, I'm going to go in with the 3D Flash Cream Radiant Primer. I'm just going to dab a few little squirts here and there. And I'm going to go ahead and rub that in. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but my face turns pink every single time I use this. After I've done that, I'm going to go in with the It Cosmetics CC Cream and just squirt a couple dots on my face. I'm going to go in with the sponge and just blend all that together. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with concealer and just go right under my eyes and on top of my lids. And that's normally all I would do when I'm on the go and then just blend that out. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder and just take this Equal Tools brush. I'm just going to dip my brush in there and then quickly set under my eyes. I'm going to do it on top of my lids. Just go in with the same powder and just set the rest of my face. I don't always do this, but if I do then this is what I do. So right now I'm gonna go in with the um, Sayate London bronzer and then just kind of dab in the places I want to bronze. Take a little bit and go on the side of my nose. I'm gonna take the blush with uh, this equal tools brush and I'm just going to put on a little bit not too much I'm gonna go in with the brows and just do my brows really quickly
So I'm going to leave my brows like this. Now I'm going to go in with the Essence Make Me Brow Mascara. I'm going to go back in with the Urban Decay Spray and just quickly spray my face again. And then I'm going to go in with the two mascaras and do my top and my lower lashes. I'm going to use the Too Faced Sweet Peach Lip Gloss in Papa Don't Peach. Alright you guys, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is very simple, very quick, very easy, on the go makeup. I look put together, but I still look like myself. Um, you could tell that I have light makeup on. Not too much, not too crazy. Um, but just a very simple and very awake kind of makeup look. I really love this look for the no makeup makeup days. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you can give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. I would love to have you guys here. And until next time, bye guys.